How's it going, everyone? I'm the Storm Cave, and welcome back aboard the Nostalgia Train. So, ooh, last one, last time is really interesting. It, what is that? There's a stuffed doll in the shape of a black cat lying in the middle of the floor. Pick it up. Sure. Hope it doesn't kill me. Plushie purchased by Yoshi for Sachiko's birthday. Literally coming apart at the seams. Well. Okay. Time to go back to the first floor. Um. I don't think there's anywhere else to go aside from across the bridge. <laughs> what? What was that? Okay, everybody's freaking out. Great. What the hell did we just see? He leaped from the roof of the building. So, I'm guessing that was the principal of Heavenly Host? Huh? Huh? Uh... Yuka, don't look! Didn't he just... Wait, what? Is it just... Yeah, I doubt he can ever find rest after what he did. So he's just reliving his death over and over again. That's horrible! Yeah. Wait, what's that? What? Looks like a key. Yeah, but a key to what? I'm gonna go get it. Why would that be smart? Don't! It's too dangerous! I'll be alright. I'll wait for my chance, then rush in and take it. Okay. Ugh. Oh, I'm sure that hurt. Got it. What the? Man, it's a lot smaller than it looked from back there. Is it to a desk or something? Got principal's key. Key attached to the gourd-shaped keychain. Found on the body of principal Takamine, Yanagi Hori. Okay. Okay, you got it. Now get back here, Satoshi. Right, jeez. So, where was the principal's office again? I'm walking extreme. I'm like, stop, stop. I think it was the t the top of the staircase, actually. Pardon the stutter. I wonder if I remember this at all. Yep. Yep. The key you recovered to, from Principal Yannick... Okay. His, the Principal's body was for his office door after all. It turns easily, and the door swings open. Kind of simple, ain't it? Why did things flash? What is going on in this room? I didn't mean for it to happen. It was just a temporary lapse in judgment. She's the one at fault. She clearly overreacted to the situation. Aww. I'm cold. Look at all the papers 
says on the walls in here. There's definitely something off about this place. Yeah. Well, they did say the principal suffered some sort of mental collapse before he died. She's the one at fault. Yeah, I'm just going to take this and run. Can I take it? Clearly overreact to the situation. There we go. I had to be on that side. Okay. What is it? There's a small hemp bag in the desk drawer. Absolutely slathered with blood. Big brother. I have a bad feeling about this. Yuka, don't look. Why do I feel it like it was a good idea he said that? A human tongue sits at the bottom of the bag, all dried up and stiffened with age. A n Wait, what? Look, what is it? Uh, take a guess. We've already found like six of these. Um, me no likey. Every night, every single night, the same dream. I deeply regret what I did. I can't even truly express how ashamed I am. But how much are you going to make me suffer for it? <laughs> okay. Oh, I understand. I get it. You're not really dead. You were just pretending. Think of the position you're putting me in. I can't allow you to tell another living soul about what I did to you. This guy's lost his mind. So I'm afraid I'm going to have to fix it so you can't ever say another word again. So he took out her tongue. You like that? You like that? You like that? Okay. All right, dude. Come on. We already, we already got enough psychopaths here. Come on. If I ever see you in my dreams again, I'll be back. I'll kill you as many times as it takes. Okay. Jeez. My goodness. Where are we on time? I'm bouncing back and forth between a couple different things. That's why I looked at the side over here. So, yeah. Apologies for that. Dude, you do realize that's not going to do anything, right? You're talking to an insane dude. Of course, of course he doesn't. Even if he did realize, he'd do it anyway. Satoshi! Satoshi! Big brother! Are you okay? Oh, well, that wasn't Yuka. Are you okay? You suddenly stopped talking. And neither one of us could get any response out of you. Oh. Yeah, I'm okay. I was just watching some unpleasant memories unfold. Huh? Inside this bag is Sachiko's tongue. What? <laughs> After the principal lost his mind, he decided he couldn't have Sachiko squealing on him to anyone. So he dug up her body and cut off her tongue. That's barbaric. I think we should give this back to her. I'm sure, I'm sure she must be looking for it. Give it to Sachiko? I don't know if this is a good idea or not. The 
this is an exit, isn't it? Whoa, it's a secret passage. There's a ladder. Hey, brother. You don't like it. It's got those charms of protection all over it. Yeah, that can't be good. Yeah, but that means the principal was deathly afraid of what's whatever's down here. You should check it out. What? I'll go first. Naomi and Yuka, you come down after. Big brother! Be careful, Satoshi. I will. And now we're playing as a Yumi, and it's impossible to go back. Is this the... Wait, is this where I want to go? Oh, no. You. What is it? Wait, where'd he go? It's a scrapbook of the murder case. A full of newspaper articles and photos. Someone circled a photograph of one of the victims in red pen and wrote in the name Sachiko Shinozaki below it. Is this supposed to tell us something about her? I don't know. Ah, look. There's another newspaper clipping in here. Seems like an older one. July 20th, 1953? Man! This one's from long before the murder incident. That was almost 60 years ago. Tension times. Heavenly Host Elementary loses beloved nurse. Eastern medicine, unlike its more popular Western counterpart, often seeks to treat the mind and soul rather than the body. One of its most renowned lo local practitioners, Yoshi Shinozaki, age 27, was found dead after taking a spill down a flight of stairs and breaking her neck. Recently, serving as school nurse at Heavenly Host Elementary, it's there that the body was found. Through song and stories, she had transformed the school infirmary into a fun, invigorating place to be. No doubt she will be greatly missed. Many students were looking forward to an upcoming field trip with Mrs. Shinozaki and have expressed deep regret at the cancellation of these plans. Though a great number of children are too young to fully understand what happened, there is a pervading sense of melancholy throughout the school this day. There's a lot of story missing to that of what actually happened. That's so sad. This had been some relationship to the... Did this have some relationship to the Shinozaki estate Naho mentioned in her notes? Yes. I think. Maybe? Okay, to be honest, I don't know. <laughs> Ah, look, there's a related article on the same page. Only daughter of deceased school nurse reported missing. And there's a picture. Huh! The hell? It's the same girl. It's Sachiko. Exactly the same photo as the photo from the murder incident 20 years later. The two photos are practically identical. How is that possible? How could she exist in both eras? Because she was killed. No matter how you look at it, it's definitely the same person. And whoever put together this scrapbook obviously made the connection too. This is just getting weird. Yeah, I would imagine. All right. Next up, second floor, I'm assuming, because I don't think there's much else to do here. <sighs> All right. Hi, Sachiko. Ah, crap. What is it? We have to hide. Now. Where? Sachiko, isn't it? Uh-huh. 
Damn! Come on. Let's try going up. I can't move. And I can't speak. It's like I'm completely paralyzed. Aw. Who are you? Something seems different about her, though. Who are you? Well, you're, you're Sachiko, obviously. Wait, stop! You cannot be. No! Get away from me! Huh? Wait, who's that? I said stop! Shinazaki? Uh, Shinazaki, I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to push you. Come on, stand up. Okay, so this is actually what happened. Okay. You idiot. Mommy? Oh, hello. actually saw him do it? Well, no wonder she thinks it's okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You saw, didn't you? Come on, move, damn it. <laughs> Get away! Quickly! Uh... Oh no. Let me guess, I gotta follow him because I need to see the rest of it. Again, no wonder she thinks this is okay. I mean, she's a child, of course she's not gonna understand, but if she sees an adult do it and she dies from it, why wouldn't she think it's okay? Dead spirit is probably going, eh, it's normal. <laughs> Wait a minute. The halls that were actually able to roam, are they the halls that he rent chased her down in? Oh boy. No. The girl who was actually hung, was it. Was that Sachiko? Because we already covered that. If she was killed, it wasn't in the same sense. You saw everything, didn't you? <coughs> well, there's the motive right there. And we covered this last time, too. This is just reconfirmation of it. Saw, didn't you? Uh oh. Shinozaki, getting out of here. Come on. Kishinuma. Wait, what? What is going on? Uh, 
Kanzaki. Wait. What is it? <laughs> Not being followed. Huh? Yoshi's accident a and Sachiko's disappearance. Looks like we're seeing them firsthand. What is he planning to do with her body? He's hiding it, isn't he? According to that old newspaper article, the mother died in an accident. I mean, it was kind of an accident, yes. And the daughter was reported missing. Oh. That's just... Unconscionable. So, if you were going to hide Sachiko's body, where would you do it? I couldn't even venture a guess. I could. Remember that manuscript Mr. Kabiki was writing? The one Moshida told us about? There was something in it about a cursed basement room that had been sealed up since the school was first opened. Do you think maybe... Good call. Yeah, let's check it out. Okay. And we are stopping here. I think Fox seems to be roaming in and out. I'm guessing she's about to go do something. So, yeah, I'm going to leave this here either way around. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Corpse Party. Now we're getting into the juicy part of what actually happened. Thank you guys for watching again. If you like this video... Make sure to push that like button, and so far you can't see me anymore. And if you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Hopefully we're nearing the end of all this soon. Um, but if you want to check out any other horror stuff that has been done on this channel, click link in the bottom right corner, and the train will take you to that destination. If you missed any of the stops on this ride, click link across right here, and the train will take you there. In the meantime, this train's off to its next destination, but we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye.